Hello, my friend. It is I, Vadim. How are you doing? Today we are going to unbox ASRock Z690 PG Velocita motherboard with DDR5 support. Let's get right into it. This is just standard cardboard box with Phantom Gaming logo on it. And we can see that the motherboard is inside, packaged very well. So it's definitely not getting damaged in transit. I'll put this aside for now and we'll have a look at the accessories. We get all our documentation, software guide, installation guide, and the CD with all the drivers. Postcards, Phantom Gaming. Oh, there's quite a lot here. So you're getting four SATA cables, all the M.2 standoff screws and uh, the regular screws, wow, that's a Phantom Gaming uh, keycap for the keyboard. and Phantom Gaming Keychain. Let's open it up and check it out. Ooh, have a look. It's made out of a proper PCB piece. So it's a piece of PCB, matte black. And this right here, is uh, kind of a replica of the motherboard that we are going to check out today. See, there's the memory modules, the chipset, all the heat sinks, CPU, pretty cool. Two Velcro straps for cable management. Oh, this is uh, an additional fan. Just a small little fan. I guess uh, that's for the VRM cooling. We'll see when I open this up. Uh, you know, when I open up the motherboard. Right. This thing right here is additional USB ports for for the back. Yeah. So yeah, that's like an expansion slot for the for the back of your case. That's a mounting bracket for the fan that we've seen just now. And this right here is a GPU holder. It's a pretty cool thing because uh, most of the GPUs nowadays are humongous and heavy, so you have to support them. And this is the antenna for the built-in Wi-Fi. With a little stand which can be 
you know, I guess that's a, yeah, that's a double sided <clears throat> tape. I wonder if this thing is magnetic. Let's check it out. Hmm, this is kind of disappointing. There is no magnet inside, so yeah. Hmm. Right. And this is the antenna. That's it for the accessories. Now let's check out this motherboard. It is very well packaged. Check out all the padding. things to peel around here but check it out this is very cool this is like a gunmetal gray nice matte black PCB let's have a look at the back of it no backplate uh, this right here is what what's holding well it's supporting additional support for the I.O. shield. Let's peel these things. Ooh, that's unfortunate. There's not, there is no tap to pull on over here. So, there is a tap to pull on here, though. So, that's good to see. Oh, wait, what? Huh. Hmm, there was no, there was, no, there was no film there. Strange. I wonder what this tab is for then. There was film here. Hmm. Oh, hold on. Is there? Yeah, there is. Uh, yeah, I guess that pull tab didn't work. Uh, it's really difficult to get this thing off. There we go. Check it out. There's a little chipset inside there. You see that? chipset inside. This is pretty cool. Huh. Uh, this is one of the few Z690 motherboards from ASRock that supports DDR5. It's a DDR5-6400. Reinforced slots. So there is a metal there, as you can see. This shield is plastic, but it does have huge, huge VRM heatsinks. Check it out. 
and it really needs it because this is a overclocking motherboard with 17 phase power design just check out this chunky heat sink at the top there is a heat pipe going straight through right there and down here another chunky heat sink and yeah i can see that there is a fan inside of here so you see that there there is a fan inside and uh, the one that we've seen is the replacement fan so yeah that's pretty good they're providing a replacement fan or maybe no oh no i am so wrong i believe that goes straight there yeah so that fan will if you want extra cooling for the top vrm you can just install it here and it will blow air through here hence the shape of this heatsink hmm very nice as for the fan connectors we get three at the top one two three four five in the bottom half so yeah that's plenty of fan connectors this motherboard has a display to you know keep an eye on the posting errors and of course as a truly overclocking motherboard it has power and reset buttons on the side of the motherboard very handy for overclocking on an open bench what may be the selling point of this motherboard in the future when nvme gen 5 ssds come out is that this is one of the few motherboards that i've seen that actually has the gen 5 nvme slot right there additionally as always pcie gen 5 for your graphics card awesome and of course you have another two nvme ssd slots right here and right here underneath this heatsink but these are gen 4 which are extremely fast as well if you ask me i've experienced gen 4 ssd it's pretty good for the front panel you get your super fast usb-c connector this is the 3.2 gen 2 x2 and also one two just the regular usb3 connectors if you are into that if your pc case has it for extra storage you have six sata ports and of course the addressable and the regular rgb connectors so that's one two three four addressable rgb connectors and the one regular audio on this motherboard is very nice that's alc 1220 which brings us to the back io this comes with wi-fi 6e built in that's the latest and greatest standard so you know you get all the speeds all the frequencies usb 3.2 type c and type a one two three four five six seven eight usb connectors for the type a that's a lot hdmi display port 2.5 gigabit lan and a one gig lan so that's two internet connections you have there optical audio and 7.1 channel audio as well you also have the bias quick flash overall i think this is one of the best motherboards in the z690 range that i've seen so far it's uh, amazing just you know just look at it it's beautiful this thing right here adds so much character to it oh it looks good let me know down below what you think about it if you enjoyed this video leave a like subscribe for more and i'll see you in the next one it was i vadim